Hey everyone, I'm Ben from the Academy of Geekery, and today, guys, I'm back doing a part three to my Java Cookie Clicker tutorial. So the first thing we're going to want to do today, guys, is we are going to want to import the Java dot util dot timer task library. Semicolon. Then we are going to want to go down into the public class and we are going to want to do java.util.timer t equals new java.util.timer. And I'll explain why we're doing this later and we need a bracket bracket there as well, otherwise this won't work. So the next thing we're going to want to do is we're going to want to go right down to our J button action performs down here. And in our grandma button, as we can see if we go here, the grandma button, uh, which is our J button 2, we're going to want to put this on a timer. So this will make it so the grandma will, every five seconds, will go and give you an extra cookie automatically. So to do this, what we first need to do is we are going to write t.schedule, and then we're going to want to go bracket bracket, new, timer task, like that. And then we are going to want to put a bracket bracket, but delete this closing bracket here and put two open curly brackets like so. And then in here we're going to want to go at override, like so. And then we are going to want to go public, void, run, bracket bracket, open and close bracket, add them in. Hey guys, the next thing we are going to want to do is go i equals i plus j take 1, because j by default already equals 1, which we want to remove. And the next line is we just need to update the label, so just j label one dot set text, and then some open brackets, and in those some quotes, plus i, and then put a semicolon after that. Then we go down to this curly bracket, and we want to put a comma, 5000, comma, 5000. And that is just setting the time, which is 5000 milliseconds. So the last thing that we need to do before we can run this is go up here, and we just need to change this i equals i plus j just to i plus plus, because no longer do we want it to be adding this number, because now it adds it automatically. So let's go play now and try this out. And once it boots up, is our application. So if we tap this button and add it up to 10, which is how much the grandma's costed, uh, got a bit more there, doesn't matter. Uh, click grandma, that'll take that off. And if we wait, it should add one every five seconds, like that, as you can see. And now if we tap it, that'll add some more and we can buy another one. And now it'll add two every five seconds. And you can just keep doing that and adding as many more upgrades as you want. So yeah guys, if you found this tutorial useful, make sure to leave a like, comment if you want to see another part, and if you haven't already, make sure to subscribe and I'll see you next time.